If there are, in fact, aliens in our cosmic neighborhood, researchers at MIT say they know how to make first contact. Those researchers say all we need is a giant laser. Now, whether that's a stellar idea, we don't know, but it is the second time this week that local researchers have suggested that there is life out there. These researchers at MIT say the key to communicating with aliens is lasers. Shoot a megawatt laser through a telescope like the one you see here, and they say it will produce a light strong enough to reach extraterrestrials. The researchers say lasers of this magnitude have been built, but the telescope technology isn't available yet. And by the way, one footnote here, there's still no actual proof, of course, that there are aliens out there even to see the light. Seems like a terrible idea. A little bit of a leap. Scientists at Harvard, though, believe that yes, aliens could exist and may be responsible for this unusual space rock that we talked about last night. The rock they call Oumuamua is the first mm -hmm. object ever observed from outside our solar system. Harvard astronomers believe it could be a tool that the aliens are using to <laughs> spy on us. Boy, are they disappointed. The scientists <laughs> acknowledge there's also a possibility that the rock is nothing more than space debris. They're watching right now going they said um, no, no, right. wrong. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well, they got me. <laughs> I just don't think it's a great idea to, to invite people to our planet. Or disturb them wherever they are. Yeah, I think it's a bad idea. <laughs> the conversation continues. <laughs> Let's